What's up guys, it's Lou from Unbox Therapy and today we're taking a look at the Nexus 7 tablet from Google. This was recently released. I finally got my hands on one. They're selling out pretty quickly. This is affordable in the world of tablets starting at $199. You're going to get the pure Google experience, meaning there is no skin put over top the operating system by the manufacturer. Now for me, that is a very big deal. For those of you that follow the channel, you know I use a Galaxy Nexus as my daily driver smartphone. I truly appreciate the pure Google experience whenever I can get it. And this tablet is going to deliver that just like my Galaxy Nexus has. Of course, in a bigger form factor with a 7-inch screen. So let's jump inside the box and get a closer look at what's included. I'm going to go ahead and put the tablet to the side for a moment so we can go over some of the other important inclusions in the package. These, of course, are also necessary components in order to operate the device. So the first thing you'll notice is a little bit of paperwork. There's a warranty pamphlet as well as a quick start guide. You've got a USB cable. And then lastly, there is a power brick for charging the device. Upon closer inspection, you'll see it is a micro USB connector on one end, as well as a standard USB on the other. The power brick is pretty self-explanatory as well. You've got your power prongs on one side, and then you've got the female end of the USB connector on the other. Here's what it looks like when it is assembled. So next, we've got that paperwork that I mentioned earlier, and as I said, you've just got a little bit of warranty information followed by a quick start guide that you likely won't need to read. This is fairly straightforward to get up and running. So let's take a closer look at the main attraction here, which is, of course, the tablet itself. You'll notice a front-facing camera on the device. There is no rear-facing camera, which some competitors do feature. This one does not. The back of the unit has a nice, soft, sort of dimpled finish here. You've got the Nexus logo embedded in the back and it's very very comfortable to hold on to since this is a seven inch tablet you can operate it with one hand you have your speaker grill along the bottom back of the device it's a long grill meaning it'll probably be tough to cover it completely when holding it which is important because you won't muffle the sound You've got your micro USB connector on the bottom along with your headphone jack. Then on the side of the device is where you'll find this four pin connector, which will likely be used in the future for docking stations or even other accessories. This remains to be seen at the moment. There's a couple of microphones too on the device. One is on the side and there's another along top. As I turn to the right hand side of the unit, you'll see the power button and of course the volume rocker. These are on the curved portion of the tablet, making them really easy to to identify even if you're in the dark or not looking at the actual controls. Now I've gone ahead and booted the device up real quick here, jumped right into Chrome, and I'm really enjoying the smoothness of the Jelly Bean operating system. I'm going to go ahead and launch the beastfeed.com. For those of you that are unaware of what this site is, this is my personal blog where I basically put everything I find from around the web that I consider to be interesting. If you haven't checked out the beastfeed.com yet, definitely go do so. I'll put a link in the description if you haven't yet or if you just want to. <laughs> the next thing to look at is YouTube, the YouTube app. Now, something to keep in mind, guys, is this is not my full review. This is just an unboxing. I wanted to give you guys a quick preview of how the device operated. If you want to see the review, definitely remember to hit the subscribe button up above and stay tuned for it. There will be a full in-depth review coming up really soon on the channel. So let's go ahead and scroll through the new YouTube app and see what we come upon. Oh, there's a cool video. Wait a minute. That's my giveaway. <laughs> if you guys are unaware, I'm giving away a MacBook Air and Xbox 360 to celebrate 100,000 subscribers on the channel. If you haven't entered this giveaway yet, the details and everything you need to know about entering are going to be down in the description through a link. So go visit that page and enter the giveaway because it ends tomorrow. That is correct. There will be a winner announced tomorrow. This is your last chance. <laughs> anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this unboxing, please remember to like and favorite the video as it does help me out a bunch. I want to thank you as always for your viewership and say one more time, if you're not into the giveaway yet, go check out the link down below. And remember, I'll announce the winner tomorrow live at my live show. All the info you need is at the original contest video. The link is in the description as well as in the annotations. I'll catch you guys real soon. All right. Thanks for watching. Later.